Thanks for joining Turbo World. This video is so special today, it gets its own intro. Just a couple things to note before we get started, just to keep an eye on. The restriction disappearing, how many people enter the room, phone charge it on fast charge, watch what it drops to. The overheating in a 70 degree garage, how the amount of views is not what they say, the amount of repeats on live recording by TikTok, overwhelming. And face and jaw manipulation on two different screens. Green screening my temperature gun perfectly in between the two screens without any of my commands. I hope you enjoy this one. This is something else like I have never seen before. Buckle up. Let's get started. All right. Let's get it going on. How is everybody doing tonight? Welcome to Turbo World! Only getting on for a little bit here. We're going to check out one of my new favorite creators, uh, Bella Sloan. She's got a video about Chester Bennington and Chris Cornell. I gotta tell you, before we get into this, the stuff she did about this other actor was right on point. You know, the one on Friends. Right on point, and she did it way before the detectives found out what was going on. Let's get started. This is fair use research of the spiritual world. Alright. And I'm back with another video on Chester Bennington and Chris Corn. Hi everyone, I'm Sloan from SloanBella.com and I'm back with another video on Chester Bennington and Chris Cornell. This is video number two and it's actually Chester I'm going to start with because his energy has been picking up for about the last week and a half and I'm sure it has something to do with Jeffrey Epstein's passing but I'm going to go straight to Chester and I'm going to go to the energy around it, okay, because he's stands there in front of me and by that I mean I get an image of him but I see an image of many people around him there's people on both sides of the veil there's people working with him on this side that are alive and in human form there's people on the other side that have been murdered like him 
they are both adults and research children, and then there's people and he's telling me this that have been tricked out of their physical bodies i take that to mean the soul has been tricked out but he's telling me that they have been tricked out they've been removed tricked okay like he was tricked he believed in them and he thought his friends were his friends what he didn't recognize and this is really strong he's drawing me um, to the focus now for some reason he's showing me um, uh, focusing on a fire there's like a bonfire in front of him and he's focusing his intent and it's a very primal intent and he's very direct he's getting ready to go into battle is what he's showing me the battle is in a spiritual sense but he's showing me the fire on the other side so there's a part of him that's connected to the fire energy on the other side and wanting to come through in a very strong way so let me start off by saying on the day that he passed away when he was murdered not passed away murdered not suicide but murdered okay so there's no way that this man killed himself and he's glad that people are starting to research say it actually is not my words that he's been trying to put in everybody's head i wasn't suicided I mean, I didn't commit suicide. I was murdered. Um, yeah, and suicided is another word for murdered. But it feels like Chester is very focused on getting people's energy to focus Allegedly. on what happened with him. So what happened to him on that day? Now, he is showing me, and I have read for people connected to him and connected to his family members. So I've read for some people peripherally around him. And I got this, but I can't always remember or retain what I say. Sometimes I throw it right out of my head. It comes in and out it goes. Dude, same. So he's reminding me that he... We call that squirrel when we're in chat. Squirrel! When we're, we're just on topic and on point and we're getting ready to get to the climax of it and we just completely lose our complete train of thought. <laughs> yeah, it, all, it happens to all of us, right? None of us are perfect did not hang himself that is how it was made to look it's very easy to say that somebody hangs himself you can't really shoot them in the back of the head and say it's suicide although we have heard that but he's saying that wouldn't work with him because obviously people would know he didn't commit suicide right with a bullet head with a bullet in his head what happened is he's showing me that his heart was basically electrically shocked and he fell okay so he dropped out of the body and they were able to make it look like a hang now, I don't know if he actually died before they got around to, to stopping the breath, or I, I think he did because he's showing me the heart was like shorted out. So it was, it, it's like when you put a cord into a, a, not a cord, when you put something, a wire without a saw into the socket and it gets electrically fra frazzled. That's what he's saying happened to him. So he's saying a garage that his goo heart on my was screen. shocked and stopped, okay? And then he was hung. He didn't hang himself. He's saying look around the house, look around where he was found. And he wasn't even found where they said he was found, all right? So the people that found him know that he wasn't found there because the body was moved several times, as in moved around. And it's shameful and shocking, okay? He's absolutely not going to be quiet so no matter who you are and no matter what you think you can do by killing somebody in the physical <laughs> this man has never shut up from the day that he died not once not ever all right we got a lot of visibility restricted my live is not eligible eligible for recommendation and restricted in search results because it may contain unoriginal or reproduced content this is in line for the for you feed eligibility standards under our community guidelines submit feedback i want to appeal uh, my live does not contain the content mentioned in the notice and we're going to go ahead and pull our stuff up here from sticky notes right here so everybody can see it so that we can see our disclaimer here does not contain the content mentioned in the notice well again we're doing a research for fair use and we we're very specific about that in the beginning of the live so I'm not sure why they're trying to hit me with this but we're gonna go ahead and submit and uh, right there and then we'll go ahead and read this law all of these videos and its contents adhere to the platform's community guidelines and are protected under copyright law US Code title 17 sections 107 through 118. As a result of the DMCA, Digital Millennial Copyright Act for fair use and the purposes of criticism, commentary, education, and parody. Now, 
This is protected by Pub L number 105304112 stat 2860 October 28, 1998. Copyright disclaimer under section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976. Allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, news reporting, teaching, scholarship, and research. We're using research. Fair use is a use permitted by copyright statutes that might otherwise be infringing nonprofit, educational, or personal use tips in the balance of favor of fair use. Obviously, this is personal use. And uh, according to Section 230 of the Communications Decency Act, the platforms which carry our content, our legally transformed fair use media, and our messages are not the content creators of our posts and are not responsible for the contents of this message in any way, and therefore have no right to label, suppress, or remove our content. Anyone removing this message without our consent or without legal grounds will be subject to major monetary penalties, which apply fully and separately to all responsible parties and their organizations. Any defamatory labeling or removal of this message by host platform or any other outside party or agency without our consent constitutes agreement to these terms. Our nation's constitution prohibits censorship of and interference with this message. It's very simple. Now, I'm sorry for that rude interruption from the platform that thinks they can define everything and doesn't really want to get into business of sharing anything. My apologies. I cannot control that. Their behavior is merely a reflection of what they want to be. It has nothing to do with me. It has to do with them. Let's get back to the show. Okay, so his energy is very strong. It's very activated right now. Very animated and very activated. He holds hands with the people around him, and I recognize some of the faces of people that have passed on, and I recognize actually people and children around him, and they stand strong on the other side. So he's basically showing me that he's going into battle. That's what all the fire energy is about he around him. Approved. So they are <laughs> focusing their energy. I hope you understand everybody that's watching this live and all the agent controllers that are watching. I'm screenshot recording this and I'm watching it message by message as it appears on my phone. So I want you to know that I'm screen video shot recording this live. As you, as you bully me as a creator, I'm going to show everybody on all my platforms how you do creators. Because it's time that everybody sees on YouTube. It's time that everybody sees on Facebook. It's time that everybody sees on Clapper. And it's time that everybody sees on Instagram. And it's time that everybody sees on Twitter. And we're going to keep on showing you acting like the bully that you are and the child that you are at the same time. Because we never know what to expect from you. So now we know every time we go into the app, the first thing we do is we turn our screen recorder on. It's that simple. It's that simple. Thank you for not approving my appeal. I appreciate that. You really didn't give me an appeal because you didn't give me a chance to write in a box. You just gave me a chance to check some box. That's not an appeal. Everybody knows that. Quit being lame, TikTok. Everybody sees you as the tyrant you want to be. Try to be something else for a change. Obviously, it's not working out for you. On getting us to pay attention to what happened. Now, my mind immediately is thrown over to another Appreciate band. you okay. lifting that uh, restriction and regulation there. I appreciate that. As far as I could see on my end, it was just lifted. We greatly appreciate that cooperation and then we uh, are sorry for any inconvenience. Okay, so there's his band and there's people he doesn't trust in his band for sure, okay? No ifs, ands, or buts about it. There's people that set him up that he worked with just the way it is. And the same goes for Chris. Chris is kind of quiet, but Chris is making eye contact now. When I first picked up on the energy. Chris's head was hung like this in shame, so there was shame about what happened, and I feel like Chris may not have understood the entire thing that happened with him. Sometimes the soul is violated on this side and sharing scaring helps share the live so we can have a good discussion. Thrown out of their body and there is What's up, Nico? remorse and regret because there's a fear Welcome that back. they did something to cause this. They carry shame. And Chris is a very up, sensitive Jordan? person. Um, also hadn't always been the way that he should have been in his life, he felt, and therefore in shame. Chester had gotten rid of his Avery shame Queen. and carried strength with him, which would be the opposite, but How he doing had worked really hard to carry strength and thought that that's what he was doing in his life. And never for a second did he think that the strength that he showed from overcoming the abuse that was put on him on purpose, 
not accidental, not because someone left them at a daycare, not because of anything, on purpose, okay, in order to control, this is what happened. He never thought he would break free of that. In fact, it was so overwhelming to him. So I want you guys to understand the level of strength that this soul, this human being had to actually come out of that, stand up, speak about it, and continue to speak and try to guide people to go in a different direction, which is exactly what he did. I mean, this man was extraordinary in his plight to make things happen and to make things different. Now, when I look at Chester and I look around, um, I'm going up the stairs, I'm seeing basically a house that wasn't necessarily overly furnished, it was kind of sparse, and I feel like he ran in and ran out. Now, I do feel like he was talking to somebody and laughing and there was someone who was a good friend, and then suddenly I'm feeling like he felt that the energy in the room, call it intuition, call it a gut feeling, he felt something was going to happen. Now, this friend that he's talking about, and there's two of them, but there were two in the house, one outside, I feel like standing guard or keeping eye on whatever was going on outside. Another one from a very well-known band in a different country. This singer, this singer hmm. came into town briefly and made a stop by Chester's house. Really? This singer is dialed up. I don't like this singer. Uh -oh. He's not a singer I like and he's this, this band, I don't listen to the music. Uh -oh. um, very popular band. I don't know if I want to say the name, oh, but I'm going to say very, very popular band, out of the country band. Person was on tour at the time. Absolutely, Chester showed me the connection to this person, and it has something to do with the European beer that was found on the crime scene. Okay, so there's one beer, there's two what? beers. One is European, definitely connected to him. Something this is that Kurt he drank. Maybe he got it at some specialty beer store. I don't know much about beer, but um, it feels like this band, this person is hugely famous and hugely part of the problem and hugely responsible um, in coming in and basically saying, it, you know, I'm sorry we have to do this, but this is this is what we have to do. So I can see Chester's face like, oh shit, I walked Popular right into was. this. Well, thank so you. there is a connection to another band member. There's also a connection, and another band is what I'm saying. Not only a band member, but another band. What's up, right? Operations very, Rest very Texas? prominent band. Um, I'm going to say the band name has two things in it. A unit. Two. That's what I'm gonna say. I can't even say it, but I'm gonna say it. Okay, so I just said it. So keep in mind, he's talking about this band coming into town, this band traveling through town. I got it very clear. Say you too. This a you and a two. That's there we what go. I'm gonna say. I can't even say it, but I'm gonna say it. Okay, so I just said it. So keep <laughs> in mind, he's talking about this band coming into town, this band traveling through town. I got it very clear. This we as society are going to find this out. He's talking about the literally the music world being turned upside down. I and mean, he's the second musician that I've channeled this week that has said the same thing. The other one being Kurt Cobain and I haven't actually oh! edited that video yet. Oh! That one will come up after oh! this one. But oh be still my heart, that gummit. My goodness. My hackles went up, my chills went up, my goosebumps went up, and I got orbs flying all around my house right now. I mean, all around my house, y'all. Wow! Uh, this place is buzzing spiritually. You don't even know. If you can't feel it, you don't know. Chester actually wants to come through. Both of them were talking to me about the fact that the music industry and the people that we in that industry, there's going to be a huge overthrowing of music in the next year, which to me means somebody's going to pass away of prominence. Not the person that came to see him in the house came through LA on the day that he died, all right? So this is hugely connected. This is connected all the way around. This is like a chess game. We are playing chess here, is what he's saying. We are playing chess. There's documents being hidden right now, and again, I take that to be Jeffrey Epstein. There's documents being hidden. There's record label executive in particular, okay? In particular, huge. Huge. He shows me the fire again, and I think he's trying to show me that this this 
this man should burn in hell because of the fire flame that I'm seeing right in front of my face. Now behind Chester, and I'm, I, I've, I've been sticking on this like a nut job for a long time, <laughs> but the brown skinned children are the children that we need to watch. The darker the pigment of the skin, they are being taken. Now I take this to be kids in, in Haiti, kids in Africa, kids in Mexico. Hawaii. Kids whose parents are- Where are those kids in Hawaii, dude? How are these parents? Like, I'm not even going to ask that question because I know these parents are outraged. So, I guess the biggest question is how are they successfully stifling the parents so much to where we can't hear them? I, I just... Mm. Of poverty. And Ch Chester's <coughs> talking about that. How the human beings in our society, the humans on this side, we focus on the financial, the success, the fame. He didn't necessarily want the fame or not want the fame. It was something he did that he thought would be cool and something that was a bit of a climb. But he's another one that's saying to me, I don't know that I would have done this had I not been pushed into that direction. So he's basically saying that he was guided and he's not sure now whether it was him or them. That's what he's saying. There are many, um, many people stand behind him. People you don't even know. People in this industry, business, and world that you can't even imagine. But they're all lining Ooh. up on the other side. So they're Forward face ready the camera for right now. Chester saying 127 that, degrees, y'all. Damn. Um, coming back, not obviously into a body. That's where well, I'd put my ear at. Time, but that's not what I mean. Yeah. He's coming back. Ooh, that's hot in a way fire, to boy. Move forward what has already been started wow People they don't like this topic at all they couldn't hear him at first they're trying Something to overheat to my phone Jeffrey obviously death, that's what the, the death, hold okay. on this is what the camera where you'd put your ear at if you were talking on the phone that's that's that that's that camera right there 127 degrees and i'm literally this far away pointing it you know, you see how accurate it is like now it's dropping now that I've pointed it out this is how powerful realization is once they know you know and you can call them out on it stuff starts changing now I told you before that I have psychic powers now you think I'm kidding These people are gifted, and I'm not gifted like she is by any means, but I'm gifted in ways. And I used to think that that was sorcery, but now I realize it's not because I'm trying to use my gift for greater good, and so is she. Hey, death. <laughs> I'm not sure he's really dead, but we'll just go with it for now. Something to do with that situation unlocking the says they couldn't hear him at first something to do with jeffrey epstein's death the death okay Excuse death <laughs> i'm not sure he's really dead but we'll just go with it that's for what now. i thought she said something okay. to that's do why we wanted with it. that situation unlocking the energy so that was a big chess move i there. mean there was a video a couple videos floating around of him in a golf cart or like driving around uh in florida i think it was and there was another video that surfaced on the interweb of him. What was he doing? I can't remember if he was riding in a car or in a restaurant. You know, and there's so many doppelgangers out there. Like, you know, right next to me, there lives a doppelganger that looks kind of like me. And, 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 you know, I could go three streets down and there's another guy that looks just like me. And I can go like another neighborhood around and there's another guy that looks just like me. <laughs> And that chess move is opening up the veil. So never we are now seeing. So I want you guys. But people like this, people like this right here, people like this know. To start doing your homework. I want you to start understanding that what you're hearing from people all over the world, what you're feeling, I want you to t try to tap into Chester and I want you to send him positive vibes because Absolutely. he's fighting from the other side and he shows me tons of children behind him the dark-skinned children come on chester along pull with through the other baby man that was in the first pull video, through the, we're rooting the for you african-american man and chris hey listen we're rooting for chester 110 
Give me some comments down below and some love for Chester. We're rooting for Chester and those children to be rescued. Okay? We are rooting for them. Chris is right over here and Chris steps up. Now what I like about Chris, what I like about him is he's finally accepted, and I want you to hear me that hear this. He could not accept how he died. His head was down from basic shame and then fear of seeing what happened, what happened in to him in his life, what he lived. Now, he was about my age at the time that he passed. I guess it's about three years ago now. And he's saying he couldn't, it didn't, it wasn't. Like, I couldn't believe what happened. He looked eye to eye in the person that he called a friend that actually took him out off the planet. He did not commit suicide. Right. If you're a troll on the internet, if you're somebody that's gonna write me, go ahead and do it. I am not going to shut up about it because I feel them so strongly. I know they didn't kill themselves. Wake up. Right. That's what he's saying. But he's saying it in a quiet and we gentle manner. It's fun. funny, he's a prankster now and we I like knew. the lightness of his energy because he actually can maneuver from the other side. There, the other side. There are concerns for his daughter because his daughter is in the same position as him. His daughter is being manipulated is what he's saying. His daughter is being manipulated in order to appear or the appearance of. So there's concern for that. There's a lot of concern for that. There's concern for the other children, but in particular, the one daughter. That Just just look. It, it's just look. Um, nobody is safe who's involved in this right now because it is coming out. This is what they're both saying to me. And there's many, many kids. You have to understand that this man, Chris Cornell and Love Chester the name. Bennington, Live your life were for you. doing <laughs> right and speaking nice. up. Also the, the black man, the African-American man, I don't know what's politically correct anymore. Anyway, Leroy <laughs> is what his name is. I come to find this out after the fact. I didn't know who he was in the first video. I, he was with the Dave Matthews Band, and he's one what? of their posse, one of their group. He was the first one that was taken out, no and he's way. the one that watches the children because he kept his eye. So oh, many freaking children so on the other side right that now. should not be there. That's so many crazy. children's souls taken out. I want you to hear me when I'm saying that. Many children's souls. And the one thing that neither Chester or Chris or Leroy can take is the fact that this continues on. They want you to start seeing. Now, what I am seeing is documents and papers are being actually hidden, destroyed, and wrecked right now. I take that to be the raid on the island and what was going on. We think that the police are doing their job or the authorities. Some of them are. Some of them are good. Others have been sent in to remove evidence and to stop it from being said. But you can't stop it right now. It's going worldwide and it's like a wave is what they're showing me. The information is coming through a wave. Wow. So there's no way this is going to stop. It's not going to stop. It's going to take about 17 months with the pivotal point being next year between the end of August and through to December. So the, the I'm sorry, 2020, the end of August of 2020 so this video she made five years ago. Through December of 2020, when we have the elections, during that time, information is being documented and information through December of 2020, when we have the elections, during that time, information is being documented and information through December of 2020, when we have the elections, during that time, information is being documented and information through December of 2020, when we have the elections. During that time, information is being documented and information again. Now we just got rid of the restriction. How did the restriction come back? That doesn't make any sense. How did, how did that happen? What do you mean appeal not approved? It went away. It was approved. You just unapproved the approve? What happened there? And then you overheated my phone and bumped me out? That's dookie. That's really dookie, you know? At least thing you could do is have, like, some sportsmanship about you and, like, you know, actually play by your own rules. That's the least you could do. But over here, you're, you're overheating my phone. Yep, we're back up to 125. We were cooling down. We were at 123 before we signed in your app. Now, that's on the forward-facing camera. Okay. So that would be the camera up here at the top. Yeah, that, that's where I'm measuring the temperature at. If it keeps on, I'll just jump over to this other phone. 
You know what I mean? We'll see if they can overheat three or four of them at a time. Let's see if they can do some tricks. We'll make them do some cartwheels. As far as I'm concerned, I thank you for exiting that message out. Now we got to go. Oh, no, it's still there. It's still there, but it says it's green. That's weird. That's weird. Okay, well, we're still screenshotting, screen video recording. We're going to continue on with this because I wanted to watch this video, and I keep on getting interrupted by overheating devices when it's 70 degrees in this garage. Like, give me a break. You know, there's no reason why y'all need to overheat my phone 131 degrees on the forward-facing camera. You know, there's no reason why y'all need to overheat my phone 131 degrees on the forward-facing camera where somebody's supposed to put their ear. There's no reason why you need to do that. Why are you being so evil? You know what I'm saying? Why are you being so evil? That's malice. That's terrorism. You're literally overloading the grid when you do that. When you overheat people's phone, you're, over, you're overloading the grid, the power grid that's already overloaded. Because the first thing they do is they go plug their phones in. Because you're draining them and that's what's overheating them. You're short-circuiting them from the inside. I know exactly how you're doing it. I used to sell these bitches when they first came out. Look at, look at the modification. Did you see that? Did you see a modifier jaw on the on the so this is another trick they've been doing for me lately and so we just got controllers that like to control our room they love us they love us so much that they want to control everything that we're doing they want to mess up everything that we're doing as a matter of fact i worked on a video recently where my camera just went in camera on a gimbal it was doing this number you know the the glitch look see it see it <laughs> Huh? What, what you got going on there? What, what's what 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 is it? What is it? What is it? What, what's the neck going on? What what's? We're seeing a lot of this lately on those teeth. Look at this, 130 degrees right there. They do not like Sloan Bella. I don't know what the deal. Is. I know what the deal is. Let, let me stop. Let me stop. I know exactly what the deal is. Hello. I don't know what the deal is. I know what the deal is. Let, let me stop. Let me stop. I know exactly what the deal is. All right, y'all. It's obvious they're going to melt my garage down if I try to play any more of this. But Sloan Bella, Chester Bennington, Chris Cornell, video two. We're, we're 16 minutes and 23 seconds into it. All right, order 109. Can you fucking believe that they oh, easy. Why do you drink to that? Why? Yeah. Alright, so we're we're trying this hot fire again. We're, I guess we're still on a restriction. We've got bumped out of here twice. Uh yeah, the appeal wasn't approved. We had six total views. It's not enough that they're holding people out of the room, apparently. That they uh, they keep on overheating our phones. So right now we're at 112 degrees, 0.2 on the forward face of camera, and you see them trying to modify the camera and change my my device, uh, which is really funny. They're trying to modify her face on the screen behind this as well. And so we're going to continue on with it because they love this so much. I'm going all over there. I'm going to the UK. I'm going. I'm going to every single country. That's what the map is. That's what they're showing us. The map, and they've all shown me this map. There are points on the map where these people are doing their kidnapping business, trafficking, breeding, ritual sacrificing of children all over this map. But it's funny because they are going to get caught. There's no way this isn't happening. People are being positioned. There's people, and Chester's showing me this. I had to have He's my saying, fan on there. Even if you cool run down. into somebody who you might think, I'll just use the example of a homeless person who you wouldn't necessarily pay attention to or give any thought to because they might be medicated, they might look smelly, they might look dirty, drunk, high, whatever. He's saying pay attention because the other side is putting uh, spirit energy, call them angels, call them helpers, call them whatever you want to call them, 
into physical form and he's showing me the shifting the shape shifting in a positive way mm. not a negative way people are shifting in and out of body so i want you to pay attention when you're listening to people speak hearing them speak understanding what they're talking about that this has a lot to do with the energy that's going on right now the veil is opening like it's exploding open there is no stopping this information. Now, it's not going to make sense in the next three months is what I'm being told. There's certain things going on behind the scenes, and there's a check and balance. Checkmate, checkmate, checkmate. I'm seeing a huge checkerboard, and I, or chessboard, actually, and I'm seeing um, things, knights, kings, queens, all being maneuvered and shifted. So when we try to go this way, one is blocked that way. We try to go over here, it's this way. It's actually literally a war right now. That is what's going on. Chester is on the other side. He's speaking. Many of you are hearing from him. Everybody who focuses on Chris or Chester and, and anybody else that's passed away, Avicii, um, Mac Miller, any of them, okay, under the appearance of these circumstances, I want you to focus on the energy and allow them to come through to you so that you can feel what they're trying to say. Because the more that we feel it on this side, the more that it can be expressed and passed on, okay? We are energy beings, and what we think, say, and feel is passed on and picked up by other people. So Chester is basically saying that. The bandmate from the other band, the very famous band, the You and the Two band, okay, that came through LA on the day that he died, he was murdered, he did not commit suicide, neither one of these men did, and neither one of these men would have done this for their children. So don't think you understand it. I can feel it and I stand by it by this work. I feel it. I will not back down from it. So you control me below and that's good. But I'm telling you, the veil is open. So get ready for the fireworks. That's what Jester's showing me. Huge fire. What was that about? You control me below and that's good? Let me rewind that again. That was weird and feel is passed on and picked up by other people. So Chester is basically saying that. The bandmate from the other band, the very famous band, the You and the Two band, okay, that came through LA on the day that he died. He was murdered, he did not commit suicide, neither one of these men did, and neither one of these men would have done this for their children. So don't think you understand it. I can feel it and I stand by it by this work. I feel it. I will not back down from it. So you control me below and that's good. But I'm telling you, the veil is open. So get ready. Maybe she's talking about the platform. You control my views below. Maybe that's what she means. I don't know. Ready for the fireworks. That's what Jester's showing me. Huge fire. Showing me the fire. I think they're trying to burn shit or trying to get rid of it um it's not going to work because there are people and I, I want you to understand this this is what chester's telling me it's something that i thought but i i i kind of want you guys to understand this okay so when the energy comes through like that and we pick up things somehow on planet earth people have to understand in order to do something about it okay so people have to be able to understand it yep. so they have to be able to experience it but there's only yep. human beings on earth so if there's human beings on earth but it's not like you know jesus is going to drop down and stand right here in the living room pop in front of the camera and say something well, so the energy well it might not be exactly like that okay it might not be as literal but i mean i have faith that God will make it happen if you're ready. Ah, uh, I said God again. I have faith. The Yahshua. Yeshua. Will make it happen. If you have faith. I like to call him Christ. You know? The army the armies are ready. You know? They're there. He's been commanding them for decades. Hundreds and thousands of years. The divine energy that speaks truth. What's up, Papa Dano? Okay, it's not the upside down world that we live in that I call reverse world because it's freaking reversed upside down. Okay, just beyond reverse. What? Sickening, actually. But the divine energy... Another nugget. Okay, so people have to be able to understand it. 
So they have to be able to experience it. But there's only human beings on earth. So if there's human beings on earth, it's not like, you know, Jesus is going to drop down and stand right here in the living room, pop in front of the camera and say something. So the energy, the divine energy that speaks truth, okay, not... But Jesus created you, right? In a sense. So, yeah, kind of. <laughs> if you channel that part of you, he is. The upside down world that we live in that I... I don't know. I guess I'm different. I call reverse world because it's freaking reverse What's up, big red? Down. Okay, just beyond reverse. It's sickening, Okay, actually. this this, this part the, right here I keep missing because you know, I keep talking drop over. drop down and stand right here in the living room, pop in front of the camera and say something. So the energy, the divine energy that speaks truth, okay, not the upside down world that we live in that I call reverse world because it's freaking reversed upside down, okay, just beyond reverse. It's sickening, actually. But the divine energy has to work with what it can. So this is earth and there's human beings. So you will find coming up in the next three to four to five months that people that walk the planet will be filled. Even if you don't like these people, it could be a gangbanger in jail. He could and the video cut off. I was getting the energy so quickly. So let me just finish. Oh, heck, man. We just had our phone heat overheat twice. It went to 133, I think it was, or whatever. Man, I forget. The highest I've ever seen it. In fact, let's check it again. Oh, yeah. 128, dude. She is nailing it. Her spiritual connection is strong. I don't know if y'all can feel it out there where you're at, but I can feel it here. Not only can I feel it, I'm experiencing it through my device. It's cause I'm in a garage. It's air conditions. It's 70 degrees in here, and my phone's pegging 132, 131 degrees and overheating and getting out of, the, out of TikTok twice on this live already. And the microphone didn't work, I think, for the first part of the live. I'm not sure. Something was going on. Something was really glitchy all the way through it. Like, there's... Ah, uh, it's just weird. My phone is doing some weird stuff. So, whatever... She's nailing it, okay? According to what my devices are doing all around me right now, trying to record her talking about this, and the restrictions that I got on the appeal... And on and on, dude. I've only been on this live, golly, I don't think even over 30 minutes. And I think we've had four different occasions happen that knocked us off the live so far. So, yeah. <laughs> Truth confirmation. Strong tonight from this unit. Thought, train of thought, if I remember correctly what I was saying. Um, the video just went poof, shut off. Anyway, um... What this Chester one's about is to too. Is even if you see a I'm telling you right now. in jail, for example, I'm gonna put both of my hands up here, so you know I'm not doing anything. There, like a head crime lord, a real son of a bitch asshole. At that moment, if the divine source can use him for <laughs> good, they just basically take the energy and put it into the physical body, oh, and suddenly that person will have information that they weren't going to say, don't know why they're saying, and said. Oh, it's dropping That's now. Kind of how it it's works. dropping. It so was 130, now it's 129. Watch for that, all right? What I get from Chris... So that's the forward-facing camera. We're going to pause it first. Oh, 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 oh. She's going to shut down, boys. She's going to shut down. Let me put my hands up here. She's going to shut down again. So this will be a, a new record for the lives for topics like i did the one where the drone was chasing the kid around and off them and that one took about 25 minutes for them to end the live but they didn't shut it down like this they can't hit this one with the restriction or anything even though they already have and they can't end it so they just keep on shutting down my device and overheating it so why, why would they want to do that why would they want to do that to my phone why would they want to overheat my phone that bad in a 70 degree garage why would they want to do that? Well, it's because they don't want you to hear about this topic, and we're going to Chris, keep on playing it. interesting. These two gentlemen are helping other people on the other side. Too bad. They are helping. They are helping. There is there, there's just so many of them stepping in front of each other right now. So it'll there shut us many. down. This has it'll been going on for kick years. It out of the there's people standing again. behind Chester and Chris, they go back to the silent movie. I don't know if you heard behind me, but there's some spiritual stuff going on outside, too. <laughs> I 
There's some noises outside, some spiritual stuff going on. It's pretty tight. Here, I don't know who they yep. are, but Device they're not like actors they, the See, there it is. That's why there I'm saying go. it. There are uh, we're children at, upon children upon yeah, children. 131.54 face and camera. together on the other side. I you know? think what has happened <laughs> is in each of their individual deaths and in each awesome. of these jolly great show okay for so my phone gave me the overheating message we're at 132 now on the forward face of camera and, and it's going to exit out of the live for the third the time of what happened just to them that wasn't available listening to, them, to her which is weird to me i don't know why that would happen i feel they went dimensionally through dimensions not necessarily up into another dimension um like up with the source i feel maybe they were shocked and thrown out they could have been bound through their own actions on earth they may have agreed to do something or said yeah i'll go along with it or watch it whatever anyway i feel like they couldn't see it's where i'd put my ear see. if i got a so phone I feel call like they were temporarily shut down and now that you know i'm surprised there it goes i'm surprised that it didn't uh i'm surprised we're not getting spam calls back to back sometimes we get spam calls back to back they want us to put our ear on it and burn our ear and try to make us sick because the battery swells and when the battery swells, it emits toxins, and the toxins can get you sick. So, yeah, pretty cool stuff, right? When they work that hard to work over you, you've got to start asking yourself questions. You've got to start taking notice. When they work that hard to glitch you out at whatever you're doing at your work, or whatever you're doing at off of your work, or whatever you're trying to do, you got to start taking notice. This is a new level for me. This is new. This is this is uh, this is new top score stuff here. Absolutely. Now we got two different screenshot footage video recordings tonight i don't know how the first one did i don't know if the first one even caught any audio but it certainly did catch the <laughs> you know the visual and they gave us a restriction so if it didn't catch the audio on the first one that's really going to suck uh however i could go back and splice it with this because i know where this file is and i can splice it back but it's still going to suck because it's extra, 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 extra work. And then while I'm doing this extra work, nothing works like it's supposed to. So all the extra work gets fought over, fought over, fought, 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 fought. You know, to the point where the, the phone stops downloading to the computer. The computer start, stops talking to the phone. The computer stops doing uh, the, the editing software programs that I need to do. So then I switch over to two other devices and then they start failing and then all the phones start failing and then at the same time you know my tv's flashing every time i'm having a device failure it's just like they just they just let me know and i feel like all i can do is just be a messenger at this point you know I, i'm just kind of i'm not really driving this car anymore you know they've kind of got the wheel they've kind of got the gas pedal and the brake and uh, I'm just trying to keep it in on the road, you know. <laughs> Imagine being a mechanic trying to share your stuff for 12 years and going through this and thinking each year when you make more money that you'll be able to afford better machinery and better technology and that these won't be the problems you'll have to face much longer. And then imagine, around every election time, the same problems get so much stronger to the point where you cannot fend them off. Look at this. This thing's going nuts. It's going nuts. I, I don't know what it's doing. Nobody's touched it. It's sitting here on a stand. And it's charging. And it's trying to kill the charge and overheat the phone at the same time. It's absolutely amazing. And it's out of TikTok now, but it's still it's still 111 degrees. Uh, 
I just want to go back in just one more time and show it off, you know? Because I know they'll do it again. They'll just keep doing it all night. And it doesn't matter that nobody's in the room. They'll just keep doing it. So let's see. It didn't even bump us out. Has anyone else noticed? <laughs> it's impressive. The restriction's still up. And uh, what is our starting temperature at on our phone here? All right, we're at 115 on the forward-facing camera. That means the camera up at the top of the phone. Oh. You know, the camera up at the top of the phone right here where you'd put your ear to if you were to answer the phone. That's directly where I'm pointing it to on this phone that's recording. On this infrared, and just to let you know, I mean, this is a computer monitor and it's at 89 degrees in here. It's been on all day. It's probably about 70 degrees in the garage. So it's not steaming hot, you know what I'm saying? But for whatever reason, in this live tonight, we've gotten a restriction and we've had our phone peg 131, 132. I can't remember what the high was, but it was 130 something, 131, I think, maybe. I don't know. And, uh, and so we've had two or three shutdowns now where it overheated the phone and knocked it out of the TikTok app because this, this topic is so hot. They see it's the time. The strength on the other side right now is not stopping. It's like a snowball going down a hill, rolling, rolling, rolling. It's not stopping. So we need to prepare for battle on this side. Each and every one of us needs to speak up against the atrocities and abuse of trafficked children and human beings. Each and every one of us. Yep. We cannot afford to not speak. Some you, me, them. I don't care how afraid you are. I don't care what your issue is. They cannot kill everybody. We right. need to speak up. Um, I feel it's extremely... The greater love had no man than to give his life for another anyway. You know what I'm saying? What, what, what more noble way is there? Important for that. But Chester is basically showing me that they stopped his heart. And then they said he hung himself. And there was somebody outside watching what was going on, like a lookout. And that person's the one that freaking called um, 911. And that was a bandmate. That's what I'm hearing. I don't know what that means. Bandmate could be his band, could be somebody else's band. But there was also the other guy I was talking about in the house. All right. This was twofold. Two of them. It was set up. It was done. He walked right into it. He's showing me that he walked into it, like walked into a spider web and got got bound. Is what mm. he's saying. Sounds a little bit to me like they were. One hundred thirty-three point three on the forward-facing camera on my phone. You know, um, magic on it. One hundred thirty-three point three on the forward-facing camera on my phone. I'm measuring it about six inches away. I'm measuring one hundred thirty-one, thirty-seven point one now. So it's going to shut the phone down again. This will be the third or the fourth time in this live that it doesn't want to talk. It doesn't want you to hear this information from Sloan Bella on YouTube. She has 121K views five years ago. This video is called Chester Bennington, Chris Cornell, Video 2. That's where you can find it at. They're going to keep on overheating my device because they really are giving us the truth trophies tonight. This is an all-time new level, so I'm going to make sure to do this again with several other devices on a live at the time because I have five or seven phones here, seven I think, and I can run a live on every platform at once and record TikTok doing TikTok shit, and I love it. I think it's great because right now we're sitting at 158 degrees on my forward-facing camera on my phone. 158 degrees. It's about to melt the case off this bitch. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I don't know how it hadn't gotten out this time or overheated. That's wild. Let's turn her back on. Let's see if we can get it to jump out again. Somebody tells me they got bound or tied. That's like a magical verbiage. 
So I feel like somebody did something to him and it's not his family, it's not his wife. With Chris, I take a different stand on that. I'm not gonna speak to that. I'm going to say I worry about his daughter. I'm also going to say that perhaps Chris was in the process of changing his life at the time that he died. You know, sometimes people are married, people need to stay married, people have money between them, people have kids. Sometimes one person wants to go and the other person's invested in not having that happen. And sometimes, as you know, one person ends up dead and the other doesn't. Usually it's a woman, but in this case, I feel like Chris is telling me the handlers took him out. Like there's Why handlers my phone and he died at the now. hands of a friend. This is this. somebody he thought was the circle his started going live on it. What do you mean? I just jumped he back, he back on. You've detected on it. So shame <laughs> on that person and don't think for one freaking okay, minute because you but. did this. It isn't going to come right back it on you. It is so because hot. Because they are all telling me on the uh, it's other side hot. that the... It's too hot to touch, damn energy here. ...energy is boomeranging back. That's it, funny. We are getting the information. It's coming out, and it is being effectively turned back on them. Now, remember that. That's it. that's also a magic premise or a black magic um, way of doing it. Whatever you do to manipulate, okay, in a spell... Not like if you do a spell like, okay, I want more money or I want health in my family. You're not taking away from anybody. You're just asking the source to bring you health or money or food or love or whatever it is. When you do something manipulative, I want that person's money. I want that success. I covet. It comes back tenfold and it boomerangs. And right now, what Chester and Chris are showing me is that on the other side, these people on this side, oh, I know I'm going all over because my, now my energy is being pulled in 5,000 different directions, okay? What, what he's showing me is that the people on this side that do this kind of magic manipulation, I'm calling it black magic, call it whatever you want, this kind of focused intention and thought and ritual, when they go out onto the astral level, so when they leave their bodies on purpose and they try to maneuver in the dimensional levels between earth and the other side okay out of body it does exist i've been there it exists i wasn't trying to do anything i just have always device overheating okay. tap That's here to see you details know what that is. google it research it figure it out um but what happens is when they do something on the other side in manipulation towards other human beings on this side to control they're being slapped back on the other side now before they used to be able to get away with it and that was why there was such a long period between this person having elevated success and then dying over here it could be 10 15 20 30 years right now it's happening boom okay there's instant reverberation and flipping of the energy so it's actually happening right now that's why the energy is so crazy on earth so i want you guys to know that it's happening and i want you to prepare but Chester is basically what I said in the beginning of this video, he's showing me. So he's saying the music world next year, and again, I heard this from Kurt Cobain, and it just like this came through to me as well. What we know musically, who we aspire, who is the top dog musically, this is all being thrown out and switched within the next year. Probably in truth, 17 months from what I'm feeling psychically, but that's what I get. I'm gonna do another video, but I must go now. Because I can't talk anymore and I gotta go to work. Um, once again. That's cool, man. The surface of this table is 77 degrees. Uh. <laughs> I just wanna take a moment to thank TikTok, our sponsor for this evening's content. Uh, if you ever want some fresh entertainment, just go and say something truthful on TikTok and get yourself a couple tools together like a mirror and a couple other phones <laughs> and uh you know your charger of course and uh, uh infrared thermometer always helpful always helpful uh and, and you'll find out real quick what topics <laughs> have real relevance because if they didn't, why would you waste so many resources to do these type of things? You got to understand that this isn't just a criminal doing criminal things. This is an organized criminal doing organized criminal things. Organizing this censorship on these certain topics. 
in such a way that your camera will shut down and literally stop recording and sign out of your app while it's plugged in the wall and still die. Have you noticed that the phone charge has been going down and down and down? It's plugged into my Samsung fast charger. My Samsung fast charger is sitting... Well, it's sitting surprisingly at a decent temperature. I'm really surprised at that. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's only 88 degrees at the charger, so that's not too bad. The whole power box itself is at 74 degrees, so yeah, it ain't too bad. But the phone at the forward-facing camera, it's still 114 degrees. It's overheated inside out of this app three times. Just trying to talk about uh, doing some research with Sloan Bella, so it must really hurt their feelings. We're going to go ahead and get off here and share this on all our social medias. I can't wait. So awesome. Thank you so much again, TikTok. So great. Oh, cute. Chester Bennington song and Chris Cornell song failed to load 432 converted over and over and over now I gotta pull them out of the machine put them on a phone then put them back on the machine after I rename them unreal one difficulty after another just like I knew it would be the struggle is gonna be worth it yeah so here's the file right right there's that one it plays and uh, it's good and then the one right beside it it's fine too you know yep both of them are fine so I can't load them so this is what happens if I try to load them uh, I can try to drag them over to audio. Yep, nothing. <laughs> Add files. Let's try it again. I mean, golly. This one, open. Fail to load file, right? Add file. And so, <laughs> so I screen recorded the screen recording and got it to work. Presto. Really interesting when you do a video and it blacks out. You know what I'm saying? Blacks out the whole entire scene. Right? One problem after another after another. When clearly, clearly, <laughs> but it ain't there just another clip to the ad to add to the end just another clip just another and another and another and another and another and another and another